Hi everyone, I'm Li Shuen from University Science Malaysia. Today I want to talk about uh, the stress factors among teachers. So let's start. There are, there are many articles, research, journal, and uh, papers show that there are high stress among teachers. Actually, they, they, it is a trend, but uh, why? There are a few factors that cause teacher in high stress. First, heavy workload. Second, to hit the performance, KPI, stress. Third, insufficient of staff. Fourth, interpersonal relationship. Fifth, students' misbehavior. And the last one, lack of quality personal space. Actually, the personal space is the recovering time for someone, for an individual. So, in this very hectic, like, hectic life, we actually, most of us uh, miss care about it. So this is also a reason that causes us stress. So in this study, we are, need to determine the stress factors among stress teachers. So from the passage from the articles, the journal show that high stress among teachers is a trend. So indirectly, there are many negative effects of high stress among teachers. Firstly, mental disorders of students and teachers. Uh, for example, the depression, anxiety, and also uh, stress. Yeah. The, the, the this three one is the main mental disorders of students and teachers. Actually, students, one of them are also uh, in high stress. If teachers are high stress too, there are a few, a few research showed. So um, if the teachers cannot, cannot control their stress, this will make the negative effect on the student. And then second, it will cause the low job satisfaction and performance among teachers. So when we are we do not have any job satisfaction and we when we reach an target but we not really happy and satisfied for it, we couldn't have the power to continue. So uh, stress we must control uh, properly. And the last one is students bad outcome. As the first point, the mental disorders of students as teachers is if the teacher cannot control the stress, student also stress, and then when they are stressed, they not really can uh, learn something and have a good product, good outcome. Indirectly, teacher stress, student stress. Student stress, their outcome no good, their homework no good, their exam no good, and what will happen? They stress. They stress, their parents also stress. This is like a uh, negative, what uh, negative uh, round, turn round and round and round. So what happened actually, there are many programs to overcome high stress, but the stress level among teachers are increasing, increasing year by year. So uh, there are a few like uh, WHO also got the program School also grow the program, PPD, MOE also grow the program. But now this like pandemic, right? Uh, we we are having the we are having the changing of teaching technique and teaching environment. So this will cause high stress also. So although there are many uh many how to say uh, many program to overcome the high stress, they are still increasing year by year the stress teachers. So from in this study, the quality the method is qualitative method. I use two. One is the questionnaire, one is interview. Then the questionnaire, I choose teacher stress questionnaire, and the second one interview. Then the analysis method for the for the instrument, I use SPSS to analysis and the thematic analysis is to interview, is, is to analyze the interview. And then the result finding for this research is excessive workload 92%, interpersonal relationship 86%, lack of quality personal space 57%, and also students' misbehavior 48%. So 
So the excessive workload with 92% is the main factor. So in conclusion, this is the stress factor that I already mentioned in the result finding. This is the conclusion, the main excessive workload, second interpersonal relationship, third lack of quality personal space, and the last one is students misbehavior. Actually students misbehavior, right? Uh, I got read some articles, but why the students misbehavior will cause teachers rest? Actually is because teacher cannot control students misbehavior and the, stu the student uh, disturb the class, the disturb the teacher teaching and cause the teacher, I mean the teacher cannot finish the target, cannot reach the step, uh, the, uh, what they want to reach for in the objective, something like that. So what the further research a program is needed to increase the resilience level to lower the stress level. So what is resilience level? Resilience is an ability to cope the stress. So there are three main factors, three factor model of resilience in the Prince and Bilbury Central and Bilbury in 2016 and Maston in 2014. There are three main. The first one is sense of mastery. Second is sense of relatedness. And the third one is emotional reactivity. The sense of, re the, the sense of mastery is about the self-efficacy and optimism. And the second sense of relatedness is how they social with others, how they tolerate with others. So the last one, emotional reactivity is uh, how they control their emotion in an in and condition their changes in their life event. So, so this is the this is my presentation about the stress factors among teachers. Thank you.